like it very much, but I don't like you, okay? Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just arrived at Jilong Station. Today we are going to Mazu, the islands close to mainland China. To get there, we take the ferry, which is somewhere over there. Here we are at the West Passenger Terminal. First stop will be Dongin. Stay there for a day. The second day we will go to Nangan. Take the ferry further on to another island, Chuquang. We will stay there the second night and then we will go back to Nankan and fly back. 1050 NT dollar, economy class, Jilong to Dongin with the Taima ferry. If I remember correctly, the ferry trip lasts eight hours. We will arrive at Dongin early in the morning. Probably six o'clock or so. <laughs> Yilong Harbor and our ship is somewhere over there. Here we are at the top of the ship, Jilong Harbor. Here you can see some of the harbor facilities. Good morning. We just arrived at Dongin. <laughs> so here we will get off. Last time we came here, we, we continued to Nankan, but this time we are going to uh, stay a day on this island. It's windy. It's wet. It's early in the morning, six o'clock. Something is burning down there. Guest house for today. It's very orange. Very quiet. Here you can see ooh, beautiful scenery. This is our guest house, and here is a scenic lookout. Cool. I like it already in Dongin. Over there somewhere is the northernmost point of Taiwan. I think we'll go there a bit later. There seem to be no trees here. It looks a bit barren. But it's very quiet. That's nice. looks unfinished.
great view from the guest house. Room for tonight. Let's have a look. Breakfast time. This is uh, Matsu hamburger. Oh, egg, peanut butter, salad, ham. Not a very big place. It's windy and rainy. Let's see what we can see from here. There's an information board. Crouching crocodile. Looks better in the sun. On the western bank of Ching Shui Ao on Xin In is a piece of land which from a distance resembles a crocodile lying quietly in the water. Where is the crocodile? Here it is. Does it look like a crocodile? Stronghold number 33 with a 40 millimeter twin cannon. Automatic anti craft, anti aircraft gun made in the US. Wow. There you have the lookout. Oh, beautiful. Wow. So beautiful. We are at the Dongin Visitor Center. famous lighthouse. So we are now going to the Dongin Lighthouse. And here are some sights around Dongin Lighthouse. There is the Lie Nu Yu Kang Cliff, the drum rock the Thai by Echo Cliff in Lighthouse. This flower is quite fragrant. It's called Hai Tong. See the beautiful coast down there. It's misty, but without the rain and the wind, it's really pleasant. Watch out for strong winds, watch your step, dangerous precipice, slippery surface, proceed with care.
Echo Cliff. Any echo here? What? You want to shout? No. Taipei Echo Cliff is located below Dongen Lighthouse and an observation platform on a lofty stone here offers fine views of the rocky coastal. Lighthouse, yeah, it's one of the highlights or the main attractions of Dong In Island. It's not a very large or big lighthouse, but it's uh, nice. It's painted white, it looks like it could be in Greece. The lighthouse. The lighthouse. I find favorite. Don't the lighthouse. What do you want to say about the lighthouse? Do you like it? Yes, I like it very much, but I don't like you. Okay. Oh, so sorry. Where are you going? Long in light towels. Down there is the a thread of sky, and over there is the suicide cliff. Suicide cliff. Lien cliff. This is an awesome sea eroded cliff almost 100 meters high behind Tian Wang Ao. in distillery. What is Libolon? What do you think about the... It's quite smooth, it's not too bad. There's no, uh, no real bad sharpness at the end of it, like with some of the uh, Gaolian. So I find it, uh, especially if you chill it, it's much smoother and it warms you up. And I'm an alcoholic, so I like it no matter what. Really? Really. The lighthouse bottle.
we are now going to the the place called the Threat of Sky here. So this is the the Threat of Sky. Oh, I think yeah, Threat of Sky. Sometimes they say one line sky, but I like Thread of Sky better. Do you? I do. Tian Tian Cliff. This is a sea-eroded trench located in a cape on the west side of Tian Wang Ao. The trench has two vertical rock faces so close together that they connect in places with the seawater below and the threat of sky above. lunch here. Noodles, meat, egg and a Matsu hamburger. Mm. We are now going to the northernmost frontier. Awesome cliffs. To the most and most point of the Republic of China to be exact. Starting to rain again. I really like this, these cliffs down there and over all this island. We are now at the Andong Tunnel. Let's see what's written over there. The tunnel entrance is beside the Dongin Area Command. This is a huge military tunnel carved through Erchong Mountain, which was completed in 1972. Interesting. going down. Imagine the carving and the drilling and yeah. the reach rock bottom. Pacific Ocean. Oh, that's a great, impressive, impressive, awesome, awesome. And the puppy head. 
So the Indian head is over there, the puppy head is over here. Right. <laughs> Can you see? I'm a sick dog. Yeah, they're both quite obvious to me. Yeah, the Indian is down there yeah. and the puppy is, yeah. He's looking up towards the sky. Yeah, and, and gives you the middle finger. Yeah. Sleeping quarters. Let's see how small they were. Oh, great. You want to sleep here, Rick? Yeah. Nice doorknob. You see that doorknob? It's totally out of place here. Looks like marble. <laughs> okay. They were officers. Yeah, storage. Shout and don't disturb the turrets. Let's see if we find some turrets here. There's another opening. Hopefully we can see some seabirds there. The lookout, I really like how the tunnel has these openings at the end. Oh, there are three openings. Great, love it. Let's see what we can see here. It's windy again. It's wet. Andong Tunnel is a great tunnel to explore. So if you look closely over there, you can see the lighthouse where we were earlier this day. Here, another opening. This is a big opening. The on the left side you can see the lighthouse and on the right side we have an awesome cliff cliff wall super cool hello soldier how is it going hey man what's up this is creepy it looks friendly Good soldier. Now back up. Zongchen. The main village of Dongin. Not really that attractive. Originally, this was a bathhouse, public bathhouse. Now it's a Minsu. Interesting. There are not many old houses in Dongin. Few of them are here, but Overall, most buildings are quite new. Oh, this is another example of an interesting old house. Not the be most beautiful of a window. And oh, there's a spider. There's a harbor. This looks more like a house you would expect in Mazu. Typical roof of the Matsu house. Over there is the harbor. The harbor again. Let's check. 
check out this temple and then go back. Tien Ho Pong Zongcheng Gate Dongcheng Gate was built in 1974. In earlier days served as a gateway to Dongin Island, but it lost this function when Zhongzhu Harbor was finished. Oh, here we are. Yensho Tidal Echo. Yensho Tidal Echo is a classic sea eroded case. Oh, here Lookout spot. Oh, what a beautiful! I think it's seafood restaurant in the main village of Zen San Mei. Oh yeah. The fish does not look happy. Rick, can you explain to me what this is? Right now? Okay, this mm. is the Ho Shou. It's the Buddha hand. It's a kind of barnacle, apparently. And they catch it just offshore here. And you break it open just like a, like a sunflower seed or something like that, a guazi. Break it open with your teeth and suck out the meat. Shall I eat this? What is the Hongzhou? Red yeast. Red, red yeast, they get red, it from red the yeast mussels. Yeast. 